when you think of Holland, you probably think of a handful of things, like tulip farms, wooden shoes, and bison. Because as I found out, the Western American icon can be found right here in West Michigan. Most of America has never saw an American bison. That can change here at Valdir Tulip Gardens in Holland, where the American icon can't help but stand out just a little bit in an area with more windmills than Western wildlife. But the Valdirs think they seem right at home. Oh, I love them. I love seeing them here. I love how people come in and they can see it where they don't have to go like out west or anywhere else to really see them. Raising the animals for both meat and as a tourist attraction, the Valdirs have had as many as 35 at one time over the years. There are only two bison here now, and they might soon be on their way out too. And now with the area developing, we need to make a serious decision whether we stay in it or whether we move on to something else. That final decision hasn't been made yet, though, because there is just something special about these animals. Got lots of people that come, and they're amazed how big they are. But, as I'm sure you've seen, some people get a little too amazed, as demonstrated every year at Yellowstone National Park. Never ever think you're going to walk up to an American bison, buffalo, whatever you want to call them, and think you're going to walk right up and pet them. Great advice because even in these docile surroundings, the bison is a well-deserving reminder of the American wild. Years ago when we were still doing some grain feed for them, I walked out because they were on the other end of the pasture to put some grain in the trough, and I turned around and from me to you stood the big bull. <laughs> I can't make that gate safely, so now you go back into who truly is the alpha male, him or me. I took the bucket, drew it back, and clobbered him across the head as hard as I could. He put his head down, he put his tail down, and he walked right over to the trough, and he never, never questioned me again. Alpha male. Alpha male. That's the kind of intestinal fortitude that it takes to have a herd of bison here in West Michigan. And if you keep your distance, maybe you'll get a chance to see them for yourself. We've got a lot more information about the bison and Veldeers on our website, fox17online.com. Reporting from Holland, Andy Curtis, Fox 17 News.